YouTube family, it's great to see you. So, Smooth Cut and DaVinci Resolve 20, it's so smooth. And we're gonna talk about this today. So, jump cut and a smooth cut. So what is a jump cut? So a jump cut basically is something that I really don't like and I used to hate it when it became so popular like three, four years ago. A jump cut basically is like nothing in between. There's no transition. You cut a clip, you split it, cut to the left, cut to the right, put it together. Just, just like a rough, rough cut. Let me show you an example of that. So you've got this clip over here in DaVinci Resolve and I've got a pause over there, right? So people don't like pauses because because it's boring and to pace your video you'll have to move forward and move faster so people will watch more so basically a jump cut is basically like a lazy way of editing because you don't even add a transition well it has its benefits and the benefit of a jump cut is that it moves the video forward it paces it so it's like so much faster but also when it's cutting so many times your eyes and your brain react more and they, they keep focusing on what you're going to do next but it can be distracting as well uh, let me go and link all these clips together okay if you're link the clips together if they're not linked go and select all of them right click link clips so now when you're gonna do a cut so I'm gonna do press B here all right move to the next bit over here I can select the clips press shift delete and I'm gonna delete everything so this is basically a jump cut and I can go here again do the same press B and then move to the next thing where I start talking select the clips shift delete so it's going to ripple delete your timeline and and, and this is a jump cut you see it's good it, it's i mean it has its own purpose but i don't like it that much now let's find out the magic of the smooth cut if you don't know where the smooth cut transition is go and toggle effects on go to video transition and you'll see here in dissolve you'll see the smooth cut so if i get the smooth cut transition i put it on here so if your computer starts to do this, that means you need to render the files. In order to render your files, go to playback, go to render cache, go to smart, and then every single time there's something to be rendered, it will render so you can play it in real time. So you'll have to wait a little bit. So that's the only thing with the smooth cut, you will have to render your timeline first or the short clip uh, in order to see it um let me go to the to the next clip over here i'm still moving a lot with my hands so i'm gonna take another smooth cut all right put it there and wait for a few seconds uh for it to render uh, let me just go here again just cut here and then go here cut here okay select it shift delete cut this again select it all right shift delete so again let me get the smooth cut transition and put it there wait for it to render all right done okay let's start again okay maybe it's too long let me make it a bit shorter let's see what's gonna happen okay it needs to render all right done let's switch it again oh that's good so the smooth cut transition it works I think most of the time it will work but you have to make it shorter so this is a smooth cut transition that is long and this is a smooth cut tra transition that is short so a short one very natural okay and let me come to this one over here I'll wait quickly for it to render let's have a look you see that's <laughs> so weird okay let me make it big oh look at those fingers crazy stuff right so what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna go and make this transition much smaller okay so i've got like three seconds okay so let's watch now all right i'll wait for it to render again it is quite annoying to wait so long but obviously what the smooth cut transition does it analyzes the scene and actually it changes only the bit that moves or the pixels that moves everything else stays the same which is, which is quite incredible it's quite remarkable all right let's have a look with a shorter smooth cut that's perfect look again even the hands if you'll watch it faster you won't even realize that so it is pretty cool again it won't work always you just have to admit that and realize that but it's so cool 
because it really it's really really smooth how it changes you don't even realize especially if it's a fast paced like youtube like talking head like this um all right let, let me have a good again look look at that that's fantastic no way no way look at that i mean this is incredible you can't even realize that there's there is a transition there look at that wow so the secret is if you're going to use smooth cut, use it as short as possible or at least play around with this and see how it works. But if you make it longer, it will look weird. If you make it shorter, it will look like there is no transition there. Super amazing. Guys, if you really enjoyed this video, if you liked what I talked about in this video, then please leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about this video. Give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing and, uh, you know, join the community.